The late Lady Diana Spencer quickly became known as the People's Princess during her marriage to Prince Charles. Having been highly regarded for her kind spirit and generous nature, fans across the globe were devastated when news broke that she had tragically died in a Paris car crash in 1997. Diana had made an enormous impact on the world in her 36 years, and with her death, people were desperate to learn everything they possibly could about their beloved princess. Biographies were penned, documentaries were filmed, and articles were published at length, detailing everything from Diana's historic charitable endeavors to her favorite songs. It's a phenomenon that continues to this day. More recently, Hello! magazine has provided a new glimpse into the daily life of the princess by detailing her absolute favorite meal, which she often requested for lunch. And we've discovered a few other special treats that she loved as well. According to Darren McGrady, who served as Diana's personal chef for the last four years of her life, the beloved royal tucked into a dish called Egg Suzette for lunch as often as possible. Egg Suzette, you can see why it was one of Princess Diana's favorites. More specifically, she enjoyed having the traditional meal on a bed of wilted spinach. If you are just hearing of this dish for the first time, McGrady offers, it's a baked potato scooped out with wilted spinach in the bottom and a poached egg on top, and then a little hollandaise sauce, a tiny amount, with some potatoes piped around the edges. As the story goes, Diana requested certain recipes more often when she loved them, and in this case, Egg Suzette became one of her favorites. Notably, the dish was actually a regular pick for another iconic celebrity, though the recipe varied slightly from the one enjoyed by the princess. The late former first lady, Jackie Kennedy, made her own version of the dish using just potatoes, and the recipe for her classic potato Suzette is still created by many home cooks today. According to Marie Claire, Chef McGrady offered some additional insight into Diana's typical eating habits, including the fact that she usually skipped the shellfish and passed on red meat entirely. Since this eliminates many common meal options, McGrady had to cinch his apron and get creative when it came to crafting meals for the people's princess. In addition to his delightful take on eggs and potatoes, McGrady often prepared stuffed bell peppers. But it certainly wasn't your run-of-the-mill type recipe. McGrady would fill the peppers with rice, garlic, mushrooms, and zucchini before adding a healthy layer of mozzarella and parmesan on top. He would then serve the peppers with a smoked tomato and pepper sauce for the perfect finishing touch. Keeping Diana's healthy eating habits in mind, the chef also created a stuffed eggplant dish for the princess to put into regular rotation. According to reports, Diana allegedly once told McGrady that she didn't understand why so many chefs serve salmon, so, taking the hint, he made sure to avoid the dish when it came to the princess. Given her healthy lifestyle, it shouldn't come as a surprise that Diana only enjoyed sweet treats on rare occasions. But even so, when she did choose to indulge, Chef McGrady knew the exact recipe that she preferred most of all. Apparently, her favorite dessert was a simple, traditional English bread pudding that she says was the best in the world, and it sounds like it was totally worth those extra calories. As McGrady explained to Showbiz Cheat Sheet, bread and butter pudding was her favorite. She would have a small portion every now and then, and only when William and Harry were at home. She wouldn't request it when she was alone. And when bread and butter pudding was on the menu, it was her favorite. She was too scared to ask for seconds in front of the Queen. Whether or not they still eat it these days, we imagine Prince Harry and Prince William have a special fondness for the nostalgia of this particular dish. And considering it's royal family approved, we now know what we're baking for our next dinner party. It's a sweet nod to quite possibly the most beloved princess ever, as well as a spot-on culinary delight for our taste buds. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more list videos about your favorite royals are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.